All right, what's up everybody? Check this out. This is uh, some sharp tools that we're gonna be using from Dent Reaper. I'm going to show you how you can remove a deep ding like this one without making poke marks, minimizing the tapping down that you will see here. Again, this is a very sharp dent and these tools are used for this type of access point, either through the opening of the door handle where there's a factory plug or you can make an access point just in that same area above it. Right. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna, we're going through this, this opening, the, uh, what is that, the door panel bolt right there, or the door uh, handle bolt using factory hole slipping up and I'm gonna watch my pushes right here okay so I'm gonna go start small and start kind of a little bit lower and so I hold my push and I'm right here okay and then I'll start coming up top with just a little bit I am um, you guys see my push I'm right here okay Now I want to give you some advice when you are pushing with this type of sharp tool, you really don't want to push it with the exact tip. You want to side load it, push it with the shoulder of the tip. That way you're getting a softer push without jeopardizing, making any highs. The other thing is to make sure that you are balanced or where you want your tip to be at is hold your push, hold it a little longer than normal. Move your head back and forth to really understand where that tip is at. Also, that'll let you know, is one side of it more unbalanced than the other? Well, then you'll have to compensate. So if you're trying to go in the center, you really on with reflection of lines, you're trying to make sure that the border is more even as you're pushing in the center, coming closer. However, board placement is very crucial. Make sure the lines or almost as small as the tool tip you are pushing with. That way you'll never accidentally make highs and hide it with how thick the lines are. I don't know if that makes sense a little bit. I hope that does. Just make sure your lines are thin enough where you're keeping an eye on your pushes. See how sharp that is, but no poke marks. Okay, no yet, not yet. Hold it, and I'm looking for my next push. How's it looking? Okay. Okay, and I'm gonna turn my board just a little bit more. Okay, just so I can get a different reflection. Now, how is my reflection? Is it out of reflection? Good? Yeah. I'm not in the way, right? Nope. Okay, now I'm just it's, I get putting a little more pressure right there. And you hold, look at guys, you really want to try not to make any push marks. Got a tiny bit of a pinch where I want. Am I in the good? Mm -hmm. Yay or nay? Yay? Yeah, well, this way? How's it looking? It, it's good. It's a little pinched underneath. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna move my board a little bit more, okay. Yes or no? Yep. Okay. 
you see there's just a barely little low here and a high there. I'll just reset this thing a little bit. Gentlemen, if you don't get it out clean, just reset it. You reset it. Cone's still going here. I gotta watch my pinches and how you can keep your texture from doing that, making, you know, making unwanted highs is you see me moving my board, all right? I have to move the board. Because as the dent gets smaller, the reflection of the lines gets smaller especially if you're pushing with a sharp tool. Does that make sense? Yep. I might be doing some commentating here. <laughs> that looks pretty damn good, I'll tell you what. How's it look in the reflection, in the video? Here it looks good. Yeah, that little pinch, I think. It looks like a little tiny bit on the, in the white. Okay, but okay, hold on. Like where? Right here? Or here? Just, right there looks like a just little. Just to the right. Like a little pinch. Right up, a little tiny bit right there. To the left. Right there, yeah. Right here? It looks yeah. like in the camera, it looks like a tiny pit, but. I don't, that's nothing here. Okay. Well, it look, it again. Be texture, it though. doesn't look like a pit to me. It looks like there's orange peel. Shoot, that's good. Now you guys know why cameras, and my angle, I can't see it. Even if it is, this I'm shooting this in 4K. Yeah. 